What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. We just got done work. It's Friday afternoon, two o'clock. I have, as of right now, three hours to hunt. It's gonna take me about 45 minutes to make it into the tree stand from this point. So we're, we're not working with a whole lot of time today. We'll end up having about two hours of actual hunting. I've already gotten my buck, I got him last Sunday. So if you haven't seen that video yet, I highly suggest I'll have a link down in the description down below for you. It's currently 3.30, pretty much been in here for an hour. Those were my first deer. Kind of caught me off guard. I was standing up at the gun down. I don't know. I don't know where they're going to move through in this power line. They're obviously kind of working my way right now. I just don't know. I don't know where that trail is that they're going to take. Time will tell if I see him again. I know they move through. They like that area in there quite a bit. They move through there a lot too, but I just don't know where they're headed as of right now. seem pretty content doing 
that. Whatever. I won't go risking a shot into all that. Not at 100 yards. Sunday when I was out, I ended up shooting my buck at five yards right here. Right there. I'll risk some brush on a five yard shot. Not a hundred, that's a little much. So. I've seen, I'm pretty sure there was about four deer in there. Sunday it had corn in its belly and a lot of it there hasn't been corn around here in probably close to a month if not longer I mean, so much so that the field that I'm hunting is planted in I would assume some kind of wheat you can see it out there it's all green bright green field is planted already for winter wheat or I don't know exactly what it is but my buck had corn in its belly so someone around here is feeding the deer corn during hunting season So, unfortunately, I cannot shoot over there. Right behind those deer are some pine trees, and right behind that is someone's house. So, to stay on the side of caution, I won't shoot that way, especially up on that hill. I'd rather not make the news for accidentally ricocheting and hitting someone's house. Just better that way. and those deer love it behind that bulldozer. I don't know what it is. They love that area over there. You can almost put money on that there's deer bed behind it all the time. I think it's going to be a wrap for us for today. If you haven't already, please leave a like. It helps my videos reach more people. If you're new to the channel because of the people leaving likes, consider subscribing. I'm going to skedaddle out of here quick. Thank you guys so much for coming on with me today. I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.